Hey everyone, uh, just want to do a quick walk around video of this gooseneck triple axle deck over equipment trailer that I just finished refurbishing. Spent about three weeks working on this trailer. I bought it at auction in Tampa, Tampa Machinery Auction. Um, my original intent was to throw a coat of paint on it and run it back through the auction and make a few bucks. As I started getting into this trailer, I started realizing that this is super, super nice. So I spent what normally would have been about a five-day refurbishing. I spent about three weeks on this trailer. So um, it's a 1997 Hooper Gooseneck. Its uh, deck is 8x24, 8x20 flat with a four-foot dovetail. So... Uh, basically a 24 foot deck and as I started getting into this trailer I started realizing what a gem this thing was so I figured basically what I'd do is I'd throw it on Craigslist um, see if anybody is interested in it if not I'm gonna run it out to auction probably third week in June so somewhere around the third week in June it'll be coming off of Craigslist and going out to auction I'm assuming I'll get somewhere around 5500 for it at auction um, just because of the condition. It's super, super nice. So I've done extensive work on this. Um, basically, I wire, once I started getting into it, I wire wheeled the entire underneath side, top side, everything. Got all of the rust off of it. And there wasn't a lot, it was some surface rust. Um, got it all off, scraped it, wire wheeled it, primed it, and then I I used a, a product called Lanco, which is a, a waterproofing product. The entire underneath side of this trailer is completely waterproofed, which is phenomenal, including the, the, the leaf springs, the axles, everything. So I'm going to show you. There's a bunch of pictures of it and that, and you'll see it. But again, I thought, you know, hey, listen, if somebody's going to look for a triple axle trailer and, you know, you're talking 5,000 pound axle, so... What's that, 15,000? That's a seven ton trailer. Um, either you're going to pay 12 grand brand new, or I'm probably going to put it on Craigslist for about 5,500 bucks. And I'm pretty firm on that with all the time and the effort I put into it and all the, all the materials and my cost and all that kind of stuff. So, without further ado, I'll give you a quick walk around. Um, brand new, brand new safety chains brand new wiring wire loomed and a brand new seven pin um brand new seven pin uh, uh connector put uh the dot reflective on it um i mounted that truck toolbox up there for straps for come alongs for whatever you're looking for um it's in super, 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 super nice shape. It's got a drop leg um, jack. Uh, not spring-loaded, which is good because you're not going to take a finger off, but um, drop leg jack. And, uh, and uh, again, great shape. I have basically this entire trailer from top to bottom has been, has been re repainted, wa waterproofed and repainted. Put uh, four four brand new side markers on it, LED. The wood I would say is probably a eight or a nine out of ten. I replaced three boards on it that were not quite right. In and as I started getting into this, I wanted this to be a a I wanted this to represent basically a brand new trailer. So. I replaced three boards that probably didn't need to be replaced, but I don't want anybody that's going to buy this trailer to have any kind of issues at all. So it was worth it to me to, even with the cost of lumber, to to refurbish that. And deck is in phenomenal shape. Again, I probably said that, but the the uh, the deck is eight by twenty four, deck over. Three 5,000 pound axles. Tires, you got six matching tires that are in pretty damn good shape. I would say you probably have at least 20 to 30,000 miles left out of these tires. 
bearings have been greased. I pulled the, the uh, I pulled everything apart and greased the bearings and got everything ready to go. So you're ready to hit the road. The ramps are in incredibly nice shape. Um, no dings, no dents, no bends, no. Usually when you see a trailer that's that's used, your ramps are beat to shit, and that's not the case with this. They're they're in good shape. There's Abby. Abigail. Um, anyway, sorry, distraction. Ramps are in phenomenal shape. Really super nice shape. Metal is a 9 out of 10. Deck, I would say, is probably an 8 or a 9 out of 10. Wiring is perfect. New side markers. Toolbox, all painted in flat black. Underneath side has been waterproofed completely. Actually, I'll let me crawl underneath there and hopefully I can get a decent picture. Sorry for the jumpy video. I spent four days underneath this trailer. So there's not a inch of the underneath side of this trailer that has not been waterproofed. And I'll take a, a, a video on the other side as well. Over there, you'll see a uh, tandem motorcycle, a, a, a two motorcycle trailer I just finished as well. That's going to be on Craigslist. Um, this is what I do. I refurbish trailers. And word of mouth is 100% in my business. It's got a 10-inch main I-beam that runs the entire length of the trailer. I don't know if the camera can focus on that or not, but it is in superb shape. I am just thrilled with the condition of this trailer. Hundred percent waterproofed. DOT reflective stickers, lights work, everything works. This is ready to go to work. Again, you can you can spend 12 grand on a new triple axle 24 foot deck over gooseneck, or you could save yourself five, six grand and, and, and buy something that's been completely gone through. I bought a 2019 20 foot car hauler last year, brand new, year and a half ago. And within a, within a year, it was already rusting. The, the paint that they put on these trailers at factory, I mean, unless you're buying a big tax, the paint they put on these trailers is ridiculous. Within six months, you're, you're, you're seeing rust all over the place, and you will not see this with this trailer. This has been gone through. Um, if you have any questions, hit me up. Again, this will be online until probably third week in June. And then I'll pull it off and it's going to go out to auction. So, but in the meantime, if you want to come take a look at it, see if this is right for you, please hit me up and you can come out and take a look at it. If it's right for you, awesome. If it's not, no problem at all. Um, this is the right trailer for somebody. Anyway, hope you all have a great day and I will talk to you soon.